Our next stop lies some 900 miles away in the vastness of the Atlantic. It's the oldest of all the UK overseas territories, the island of Bermuda. The English settled here in 1612, so the main island is developed from shore to shore. It's teeming with people, but Bermuda has an amazing story to tell. Perhaps the most surprising story in the whole of the Caribbean. The English weren't the first to come here. The islands were discovered by the Spanish just a few years after Columbus's arrival in the New World. But the Spanish didn't stay. As they dropped anchor offshore and the sun began to set, the air was filled with unearthly noises. These noises frightened the Spanish. They were convinced the islands were home to the devil. They never came back. When the English settled over a hundred years later, they realized there were no devils here. Just huge numbers of seabirds they called cahows in imitation of their strange cries. And instead of being afraid of them, the English simply ate them. Bermuda was the only place these birds nested. And by the 1630s, the cahow was marked down as extinct. But in 1951, something amazing happened. A few pairs were discovered on a group of tiny islets off the main island. No one had seen this bird for more than 300 years. It was like finding a living dodo, an astounding discovery that set the natural history world on fire. But their rocky homes were exposed to high seas and hurricanes. They needed a new home. The island Nonsuch has been cleared of introduced predators. All it lacked was Bermuda's charismatic devil bird. But conservationists had a problem from another protected species, the tropic bird. They evict cahows from their burrows and even kill them. How to persuade tropic birds and cahows to live together? And this is the answer. Tropic birds love these man-made burrows, and with competition for nest sites reduced, the reintroduction of cahows could begin. Starting in 2004, cahows were moved by conservationists from their tiny islets to Nonsuch Island. Just a decade later, the plan appears to be working. Today, cahows are breeding successfully on Nonsuch. This huge and ungainly looking chick will soon fledge to soar far and wide over the Atlantic, and yet will still be able to find this tiny island when it is ready to return home to breed.